The god of the day has vanished. The light from the hills has fled. And the hand of an unseen artist is painting the west all red. All threaded with gold and crimson. And burnished with amber dye. And tipped with purple shadows. The glory flameth high. I think of the souls that are straying in shadows as black as night, of hands that are groping blindly in search of a shining light, of hearts that are mutely crying and praying for just one ray to lead them out of the shadows into the light of day. And I think of the souls that are yearning to follow the good and the true. They are striving to live unsullied, yet I know not what to do. And I wonder when God, the Master, shall end this weary strife and lead us up out of the shadows into the deathless light. Are you ready to visit with Pinto Pete and his ranch boys? The camp is right over there, right over yonder. Come on. a great surprise for you. What is it, boss? <laughs> well, next week, I'm going to take you boys into town for the weekend. Oh, <laughs> let's go. I sure do yearn for the city dust in my nose. Let's go and get to see my gal. Me too. Yes, I thought you two fellas was off the wood. The girls. Off the girls, nothing. That was last week, Shug. But when we go to town, that's different. Ain't it, Curly? <laughs> you <laughs> let it. They left things happen to blow off steam. All what right, let it go. Now the moon shines tonight on pretty red wing. The breeze is sighing, the night birds crying. For afar neath the star her grave is sleeping, while red wings weeping her heart away. There once lived an Indian maid, a shy little prairie maid, who sang each day a song so gay as on the plain. She'd while away the day, she loved the warrior bold, the shy little maid of old. And brave and gay, he rode away to battle far away. Down the moon shines tonight on pretty red wing, the breeze is sighing, the night we're crying. For afar neath the star, her brave is sleeping, while red wings sleeping, her heart away. Yeah. You know, boy, if a feller had a gal like that, it sure would be too bad if he had to leave her, wouldn't it? You sort of sound as though you'd had some sad experience with the girls, Curly. Huh. They ain't only sad, boss. They're all downright heartbreaking. You know? <laughs> so, you know, I'm wondering how you ever got fur enough to have an experience with a face like you're wearing. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Looks like a worn out saddle. <laughs> Blanket to me. Me too. This <laughs> isn't here, you two. If I had a face like either one of yours, I'd hire out to for a scarecrow. Yeah, yeah. You'd yeah. never it, even it, work as a scarecrow. You wouldn't scare no crows. You'd flat frighten them plumb death. Hey, no, boy, I would not. not to interrupt you, but I believe I'd rather hear you sing. Well, Joe, go on down to <laughs> old sunny south, will you? All right. Come on, let it go, sir. In my dear old southern home, I was happy as I could be, where the mockingbirds sing. At night while we rest, at dear old sunny south by the sea. Oh, lady, And my mother and my dear old dad. When I left them, I know it made them sad. But I'm going back to that dear old shack where I spent my happy days as a lad. Goodbye, friends, I'm leaving today. Goodbye, friends, I'm going far away. I'll be happy and so free here, my dear old man is me, my little old log cabin needs a tree. Lady, 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 oh lady, oh lady,
Jiffy! Say, Shorty, instead of sitting over there looking moon-eyed at them pretty gals, get that French harp of yours and blow us out of tune, will you? Sure is a shame, ain't it, Jack, that old Shorty don't work around a blacksmith shop. Why, Curly? Well, the way he heaves and puffs at that old French harp, doggone it, we could just attach him up to the bellows and save a lot of trouble of pumping it up. (laughs) Shorty, I'd be plumb insulted if I was you. Well, doggone I am, so I'm going to sort of punish him by playing. Oh, that's right, Shorty. Go on, Shorty. Plum over into the next county. Well, it may have blown, but it didn't blow nothing like it used to down in Texas. Hey, they really do have some windstorms down there in Texas, don't they, Jack? Yes, indeedy. <laughs> Say, Pinto, you know, I remember one time it blew so hard that the fish had to swim upstream backwards to keep the dust out of their eyes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir, and another time it blew so hard that it finally blew the mortgage off my granddad's farm away down there in Texas. I <laughs> thunder I remember that. How come you remember that? Well, that same wind that blew the mortgage off in your grandpappy's ranch in Texas... Blew it plump into Oklahoma where it landed on my grandpappy's ranch. What do you know? He lost the ranch because he couldn't pay your granddad's mortgage. Oh. (laughs) (laughs) Say, Jack. Come on. (laughs) I think we'll have to sing something about a little old brown jug here and let her go. Come on. Turn her loose. Ha, 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 you and me, little brown jug, don't I love thee? Ha, 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 you and me, little brown jug, don't I love thee? My wife and I lived all alone in a little log hut we called our own. She loved gin and I loved rum, tell you what, we'd lots of fun. Ha, 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 you and me, little brown jug, don't I love thee? Ha, 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 you and me, little brown jug, don't I love thee? Tis you who makes my friends and foes, tis you who makes me wear old clothes. Here you are so near my nose, so tip her up, and down she goes. Ha, 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 you and me, little brown jug, don't I love thee? Ha, 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 you and me, little brown jug, don't I love thee? (laughs) (laughs) Say, boss, how about you closing off this evening with something sweet so we can just lay down there and peek up at the stars? Well, to be telling the truth, Jack... After all said and done, I guess I love you truly. Oh, man, look out. All right.
moon stands high in the sky and bids fair to light your way along the trail to your camp, friend. Come again, won't you? So long. Thank you.